Hello everyone, so me and Aiden have been out this morning, I had to take some photos, but we've just been to Bewitched, which is like a coffee place. Is it local to us? Yeah. I think it is, it's like in Northamptonshire. There's like four of them. Um, but the, yeah, there's like about four of them, I think they're like spreading. <laughs> they're spreading. They're but defo, if you're ever in Northamptonshire, <laughs> check out Bewitched because it is the best. This is a vanilla ice, was it vanilla ice iced coffee? Vanilla shiver. Vanilla shiver iced coffee um, with soy milk and cream because I don't make any sense. And then Aiden got the honey honeycomb blast and that tastes unreal as well. They do lots of different like cool flavours of iced coffee and then loads of different flavours of like milkshakes. And then they obviously have all the um, yeah iced tea and then they have obviously all the basic like it's not even that ones. Yeah, there's like similar like, prices to like Costa, Starbucks. It's all like the underneath the Starbucks. Mm. Pussy bottle, mate. Bottle. Put your fucking mouth shut. Put your fucking mouth shut. Yeah, we're just heading back now. We just stopped at co-op, got some pita breads. <laughs> and we've got some different um, flavoured hummus. Because we're going to have a little bit of a snack and then get on with some revision, aren't we? <sighs> but we're going golf later, so that's our motivation to like do lots of work. I think we should put our phones aside. Maybe use hold, which is a really cool app. <laughs> Not a spawn. <laughs> Wonder if your mum will notice that I've changed my outfit. You're caught in the act. Caught in the. Are you going to show everyone on the vlog how good you are? Look, you even sat already before I've said sit. Sit. And then you're going to pour. Good boy! Look who's sunbathing over here. <laughs> Look who's sunbathing over here. The only little patch of sun. Are you gorgeous? Are you glowing in the sun? Hey everyone, so it is Saturday. Um, yesterday was so lovely. Me and Aidan went to the new adventure golf thing called Paradise Island or Adventure Island at Russian Lakes, which is um, like a place that has recently been built near us and they keep expanding it, which is absolutely great. So it's nice that there's like a little mini golf course um, close to us. So we did the Temple Ruins one. It was super fun. There's 18 holes on each and we managed to get it for seven pounds each because me and Aidan are students. So we thought that was pretty good. And I think there's like a deal if you do both. Um, so yeah, it's very good. So if any of you are local or end up coming to Russian Lakes for a day, because I mean it's expanding and I, I'd probably like come here for a day. Like I used to go to Milton Keynes a lot for like the day um, and it's sort of like becoming something similar to like MK1. So I definitely recommend it and there's lots of other bits and pieces to do for the kids. There's lots of restaurants being added constantly. We went to Pizza Express for dinner and it was delightful. And then I just did a lot more work and stuff. 
all good. Um, today I have just been tidying my room. It's an absolute bomb site because I still have stuff like left over from Christmas and I, I'm not home for very long at all like when I'm at uni. So after Christmas, like I pretty much was, have been at uni since and now is like my proper break back. So yeah, I haven't really had time to sort all my room out. It's literally so messy still over there. You can probably see. Um, I just want to get it all nice for like the end of third year next year. Um, so I just feel like comfortable and nice in my own house and you know, I don't, my room, I used to like come home a lot when I was at school and I'd like cry in my bed and it wouldn't just, it just wouldn't be a nice place for me to come back to even though I did spend a lot of my time here like isolating myself and stuff when I was going through bits and pieces at sick form. Um, I just wanted to have like a big change in my room which is really exciting because in a few weeks time I think I'm uploading it on the 7th of May I've got an exciting vlog coming up um, working with a really cool brand that you might have heard of before and thankfully I've managed to get a 25% discount so I feel like a lot of people use it I'm literally going to use my own code I think Hattie wants to use her own code because she's redecorating her room Megan might use it I'm not really sure but um, yeah I'm literally decorating my room and this brand is really helping me out with something that I've wanted to do for ages and something that I was going to do anyway so it's really nice that I'm getting helped out and I feel like you lot will be you'll be really excited because it's an affordable brand and 25% discount is me massive so yeah very very excited woohoo but yeah I'm just about to film the content for that video going up early May and then I'm going to get cracking on with some work I'm really excited to film some videos as well that are like main channel sit down chatty I want to do an exam season preparation I want to do some more taboo Tuesdays let me know if there's anything else you want to see um also I just thought I'd recommend to you guys if you haven't seen it already but on channel four is it channel four or all four is it the same thing I don't know but we've been watching it on demand and me Aiden and Aiden's mum have literally been obsessed with Derry Girls um it's like based in Northern Ireland and they include some of like the conflict and stuff like the IRA and bits and pieces and um, from like the Northern Irish history which me and Aiden actually studied when we were doing GCSEs together uh, which is so weird because like I don't know it was it's just weird thinking back at it and like being in a classroom with Aiden is just so strange um, but yeah, we used to do history together and Northern, the Northern Irish conflict was one of our like topics that we had to do for one of our essays and it sort of incorporates that but it's like a comedy and for me, I find it really hard to get into comedies um, unlike TV series and stuff because I have like a very specific sense of humour like some things that my boyfriend watches I'm literally sitting there like so um, it's I, I was a bit sceptical, I was like mm, I don't know if I'm going to like this but I, I literally find it hilarious, I think the comedy is just really funny and we've all been having a laugh watching it, I think the episodes are around 20 to 30 minutes long so they're super easy to get through and I think there's two seasons so far, I have no idea if they're carrying it on, I haven't done my research but I've watched about five episodes so almost the whole first season and I just love it, I think it's really great um, and yeah I don't know, let me know if you've been watching it or if you think you're going to try watching it let me know if you watch an episode because i'd really love to hear your thoughts and if you get it as well or if you don't like that humor um but yeah that's what i've literally been binging over the last few days thought you might want a little bit of a recommendation over the easter period to have a nice little break between revising or whatever you're doing and let me know if you're having a nice easter weekend because it's bank holiday weekend i'm just gonna get filming my content now Oh my god, so this incredibly talented girl, I'm going to leave her Instagram on the screen and in the description, has drawn a photo of me and Aiden that literally looks identical to the photo that I sent her. Um, she was super, super kind and lovely and she watches my videos and I just appreciate her so much for all the support and then for her to draw something like this is incredible so go give her a follow because her, she is super talented I'm going to pop the original photo but next to the screen so you can see how amazing it is tearing up when she sent me this because I just thought it was such a kind thing for her to do it took, obviously took her a lot of time and she is just an angel and actually sending it to me so I can't wait to receive this just, I, I just can't believe how talented and amazing people who watch my videos are like oh I just I love you I love want to meet everyone <laughs> um me and my dad have finished sorting out the thing for my other video that's going up in the beginning of May I am literally so excited for it so here is a little sneak peek which I probably shouldn't be showing you but I'm about to go get my hummus and pitta and do a bit of editing before I get on with some revision for the evening just about to edit and my brother is the kindest person in the entire world and bought us all easter eggs so I'm gonna indulge as it is easter weekend in my little Cadbury's egg
Right, so I'd actually been vlogging today, it's Easter Sunday. Um, however, all of the footage corrupted on my SD card, so apologies about that. But to be honest, I haven't really done too much today. I've been filming main channel videos. I have uploaded an exam season preparation video on my main channel, so I will leave that down below so you guys can go watch it. Um, I just left all of my tips and things I'm doing to prepare for my summer exams, so hopefully it helps you guys out if you're doing your A-levels, GCSEs, or your uni exams like me. I've literally just had a pretty chill day. We went this morning to my cousin's house, which you might have seen, um, because I think I took a couple of clips on my phone. We literally went round there this morning. Um, Aiden has gone home because his exams start way earlier than mine and finish later, so he's gone back to prepare for all of his. So it's really sad because it was like the last night we spent together, but it was really lovely anyway. But yeah, literally just been filming main channel videos today and doing some editing. I really should be cracking on with my revision now, so I'm gonna just make a revision timetable. It's almost nine o'clock, but I just wanna make sure I have all my revision set starting Monday tomorrow, and I'm gonna get right on with it because I've got one more week before I go back to uni and then I've got a week of lectures then exam season begins. My first exam is on the 16th of May which does seem quite a while away but I will literally be uploading so much content of me revising and studying hard so you guys can get motivated with me so yeah tomorrow I'm gonna I'm planning on doing my first real-time study with me which I'll be I'll be uploading onto my main channel so make sure you're subscribed to me over there. Let's make my revision timetable. to get a god tier easter egg i mean nestle are not my favorite eggs but when i saw this orange smarty one i fell in love and my nan was a gem i didn't even know she did this but she went and bought me an orange smarties easter egg absolutely love her and there's orange smarties inside i'm absolutely buzzing so thank you very much then i've got some other bits and pieces for my family i've already eaten some of them but um i wasn't expecting or asked for easter eggs or anything but Everyone's been just so, so lovely. I've got some Freddo faces here. I've got a Kit Kat Chunky one here. I've got some cream egg. I've already eaten my crunchy one from David the other day. And yeah, just thought I'd show you guys my Easter eggs. Dairy milk's always my favourite, like the dairy milk eggs, but this is a winner this year. Thank you very much for watching my Easter weekend vlog. I hope it has been enjoyable. Make sure to hit thumbs up if you did if you did enjoy it, subscribe down below if you're new. I have a lot of revision videos coming, so stay tuned if you like that sort of thing. I've been filming some really funny main channel videos, so make sure you're subscribed over there. Me, David, and Sophie filmed a, like, spill your guts, fill your guts, like James Corden style sort of thing. And it was horrendous. Um, and we actually spilt the tea, so make sure you're subscribed because I'll probably be uploading that on Wednesday, possibly. Yeah, I think Wednesday, so, ooh, yeah, I'm really scared, but... I tried being honest because I literally hate eating food so much. Like, I'm very fussy eater, so... Ugh. Yeah, thank you very much for watching. Let me know if you celebrated Easter or did anything this weekend. I just sort of had a very chilled time revising, seeing a few family members and stuff. And, yeah, I will see you in my next video. Bye.